All right, now on to example number five. Again, I went ahead and did the original points. F at 6, 7, G at 7, 4, H at 3, 4 ahead of time just to make the video a little bit shorter. So you could pause the video and write that down if you want. Leave that space above, though, to write the translation down. Anyway, example five says, translate triangle FGH eight units to the left and five units down. I went ahead and crossed out the verify part because we're not going to do that, just like uh, we crossed out in example four. So I'm going to uh, highlight eight units to the left. You should underline that. And five units down, you should underline that. The translation for example five, eight units to the left, to the left means subtract eight. And five units down means subtract five. So above my x coordinates, I'm going to put minus eight. Above my y coordinates, I'm going to put minus five. So for f prime, six minus eight or negative eight plus six, however you want to look at it. Um, six minus eight would be negative two. Seven minus five would be positive two. For g prime, seven minus eight would be negative one. Four minus five would also be negative one. For h, three minus eight would be negative five. Four minus five is negative one. Now we're going to plot these. So negative two, positive two, that's where f prime is. Negative one, negative one, g prime. And negative five, negative one is h prime. Now we're going to connect the dots. Please make sure you're using your straight edge to do this. And that is example five. Well, we're just going to test it just to make sure. Um, let's go, let's use point F. So eight units to the left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And five units down. One, two, three, four, five. So eight units to the left, five units down. You should do that with each of the points to double check to make sure that you plot it correctly. And then also make sure that the two figures, the pre-image and the image look congruent. Um, and that is it for the notes. If you have any questions, uh, don't hesitate to ask, but make sure you get all of the um, work copied down and then you can download the or upload the Bellwork 17A to Schoology and there'll be another, or sorry, Bellwork 17A to Notability and there'll be another video on that. All right, thank you.